here we have a solid boulder opal and isn't it interesting look at that this is a hundred percent natural it's not a doublet triplet inlay or synthetic this is the real thing just it's just so interesting so um it would have either formed like this or i think we're more likely to say that it formed like this so you had a, a different uh, actually we're looking like this i think because it's got this little pool and a little bucket um where the the different layers have actually formed yeah that's that's the way it formed so um it's it, so what happened in, in, with boulder opal is that it, the, the silica solution formed inside tiny little em empty cavities um and then uh a, a, another so we've probably got how many vents here one two three four okay so um silica solution it was would have been a, 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 it would eventually turn into a gel um and then eventually turn to opal so we've got these little um, events here which have, has at a later date we've got the, some more silica solution going in then another later date where more silica solutions gone in so it's kind of pushed and moved it around so you get these amazing amazing patterns which um, is, is second to none when it comes to gemstones it really is uh, outstanding better than black opal all those other gemstones this is fantastic we love boulder opal here with that pattern it's just got such a good wow factor so it's so simple, but because of that color uh, and that pattern, it's very compelling, very captivating. People are going to comment on it because it's just so unique. So if that's what you want, this is the one for you. But don't wait. You can't get anything else like it.